Well, we have the most perfect day for you. A warm hello in every sense of the word. The sun is out and football has a special place on this most idyllic of days. A fixture ahead of us to which we've all been looking forward for so very, very long. And it means so very, very much. The scene could not be more beautiful. The pitch looks terrific. The players are ready to get started. And we cannot wait for the contest that lies ahead. It's a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages. One of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world. Krasnodar have opted for a 4-5-1 formation, it appears, Jim. Well, the lone striker has to be prepared to do some of the work himself, but essentially he needs two of the three central midfielders runs beyond him and trust that the wide men can can service the penalty box and make those link-up runs from out to win. He should get plenty of support with this setup. And that gets things running. It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out muscled. Has gone out. Whipped it. Up to meet it! Oh, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. Hoists it forward. Forward it goes. And for a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Krasnodar are enjoying the line, share of possession, but nothing yet to show for it. Plays it out to the flank. And the weighted pass, timely intervention. Tries to get it forward quickly. Come back to the keeper. Well, they would seem to be trying to expose the centre of that defence to, to runners. It makes for some terrific movement. It does, and they may be hit on the break because obviously it requires numbers forward to, to stretch them out. Precious little by way of goal mouth action yet. Puts it into the middle. And he's there to clear it. Spartak Moscow get it back again. Just five minutes left until the break. That is terrific skill. A chance to play it in. Shala. And here's Shala. He's had a go! He's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. So both sides have drawn blanks. They have toiled at times, but it's not been a bad game by any means. An engrossing half, but we're still where we started. Real nil. That gets things going for the second half. At least there's always a plus side to a scoreless half. Defences are doing what they should, and it's going to take good imagination to break the deadlock here. It's a loose ball. Aimed in towards the centre.
Drives it towards the front. Oh, good interception. Truthfully, it was hard to see any better outcome there. In with the challenge. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Good challenge, he just stood firm. There's a long ball. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection of what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. Turns and goes back. Played out to the right. Hit into the middle. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Gets into a dangerous position. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Well, what we're witnessing now just goes against the grain. They're not going to get back into the game like this. That's not going to make it. And that's it. And stalemate. One, if not for fans, then perhaps for coaches. Satisfied by organisation and solidity. A little cutting edge at either end. And it finishes nil-nil. Your reflections then, Jim. Krasnodar can always...